In this video, I'm going to show you how to create faceless videos for YouTube using AI super fast. So the tool we're going to be using creates high quality professional videos using AI and it will create your script, source all your B-roll footage, add background music, add your subtitles and even add a human sounding voice. Now this tool we're going to be using has a free plan. So if you want to follow along with me, then use link in the description below this video to access the free plan and follow along. So using that link will bring you to this page where we're going to be using InVideo AI to create our faceless YouTube videos. Once you're on this page, come to the top right to click on the button to sign up and then here you can get access to the free account just by simply entering your email address and then once you're logged into your InVideo AI account you'll see a page that looks something like this click on the button at the top left here that says create AI video and now here we can give text prompts to start to create our video however a much better option is to come down to the bottom here where it says workflows and plugins you can click on the explore all button to see all the options you've got here to create faceless videos with AI and we're going to choose the YouTube explainer video now here at the first option where it says create, we've got a drop down to select the length of our video. So as this is a long form video, we can select how long we want this to be up to 25 minutes. Or if you want it longer than 25 minutes, you just select the other option. I'm going to select this video to be five minutes long. Now, if you're specifically interested in knowing how to make faceless YouTube shorts using InVideo AI, then you can watch this video that I'm showing on the screen right now. This is a video on my channel and I'll link it in the description below this video so it's easy for you to find it. Alternatively, if you want to know how to make faceless TikTok videos, then you can also see this video that's also on my channel. Again, link is in the description of this video. Now moving on, so we want a, in this example, a five minute video. And now here is where we can enter some information about what type of video we'd like. So in this first box, I've just asked InVideo's AI to make an engaging YouTube video on what would happen if I fell into a black hole. And then the second box here is where we need to just enter a few facts and opinions about this topic that the AI can use for the video. Now, I know almost nothing about this topic, although I do find it quite interesting. So I went over to ChatGPT to ask Chat to give me five different facts about this topic that I could feed to InVideo's AI. So I'm going to copy this information here and then head back to InVideo AI. And I'm going to paste that content in this second box here. And now the next section is about background music. So in this field, we can enter what type of music we want. I'm going to ask for a dark and haunting. And here we've got the language we can select. Now we've got over 50 different languages you can select with InVideo AI, and they're currently adding more to their platform. So of course I'm English, so I'm going to stick to English. And then under here is where we can select what type of voiceover we want to use. So from the first drop down, we can select a male voice, a female voice, or my voice. So with my voice, you're actually able to upload a sample of your own voice to NVIDIA AI. Then NVIDIA AI will clone your voice and then use that in all of your videos or any video that you choose to use your voice in. Now I have tested this out and surprisingly, it's actually really good. It does actually sound very much like me when I did my voiceover. So if you want a demo of that and you want to see how to actually add your own voice so NVIDIA AI will clone your voice, then you can watch this video that I'm showing on my channel right now. And again, I'll leave a link to that video in the description of this video so it's easy for you to find it. Anyway, for this example, I'm going to choose a female voice. So this way, InVideo AI should select one of its own AI generated voices just so you can hear the quality of those. And now here from the any voice, I can choose what type of accent I want to use. So if I scroll down, I'm going to choose an old husky British voice for the narrator. And here for the subtitles, we can add subtitles and we've got different options for the style of the subtitles. Now I'm going to choose this option here, add bold subtitles with a popping effect. You also do have other options like the karaoke effect, for example, which will highlight the spoken word, which is pretty cool. I'm just going to go with this one for now. And now here you can select where you want the AI to source your B-roll footage from. We're going to leave it on iStock. And now here we can select where we want our background music to be taken from. I'm just going to select this one, use best audio available, and then click continue. And now here the AI has pulled our prompt into this box. We click on the button here to generate your video. InVideo will analyze your prompts and all of your instructions. And now here InVideo is asking a little bit more information on the audience. So the options we've got here is science enthusiasts, space lovers, or curious minds. Let's go with curious minds. Look and feel dark and gothic, dramatic or epic. I'm going to go with dramatic. And the platform is YouTube. Click continue. And now here in video AI will start to create our video for us. Now, as this is a five minute long video, this is going to take a few minutes for in videos AI to put this together for us. So I'm going to pause the video and I'll be back with you once it's ready. Okay, so that took about three minutes to put this together. So let's watch the video and see what it's like. But before I press the play button, you'll notice here there's a watermark and there'll also probably be an NVIDIA AI branding mark on the video as well. But don't worry about that. When you come to download the video, you get the option to remove those watermarks if you want to. And of course, you probably will want to. And just so you know, before I play this video, I'm going to have to switch my mic over to my computer mic. So it will then be able to pick up the audio on this video. But it's not going to be as good quality. But I'll switch back to my regular mic afterwards. Also, I'm not going to play the whole video because it's five minutes long. You probably don't want to watch the whole thing, but let's watch a sample of it and see what it's like. 
Ever wondered what would happen if you fell into a black hole? It's a question that sends shivers down our spines, a cosmic horror story waiting to be told. Black holes stand as one of the most mysterious and terrifying phenomena in the universe. These gravitational behemoths, remnants of collapsed stars, possess a pull so strong that not even light can escape their grasp. Join me as we journey into the abyss, exploring the mind-bending realities of what happens when we get a little too close to these cosmic monsters. Picture this. You're approaching a black hole, lured in by its irresistible pull. At first, you might not even realize the danger, but soon, the gravitational gradient becomes apparent. The force on your feet becomes exponentially stronger. Now that's pretty damn good. I'm really impressed with this. I mean, the B-roll footage is great. The music's really good. It's like eerie and quite fitting for the video. And what do you think of the voiceover? I think that voiceover is great. It's very human-like and it's got good expression in the voice as well, which is brilliant. Now, if you did want to make any changes to the video, there's a couple ways you can do it. First of all, you can enter more prompts down here. For example, if you want to make the music a bit quieter, you can just say, make the music 30% quieter. And you can also actually add multiple prompts in here as well. So if you want to put a comma and then write another prompt and then a comma and another prompt, then click generate in video AI. We'll then spend a couple of minutes redoing your video and making those changes for you. Now, alternatively, if you want to get more granular on the type of editing you want to do, then click this edit button here and this will bring you into the timeline of the video. Now up here in the top left, you've got three options. We've got edit media, which is currently selected, or we've got edit script or edit music. So on edit media, this is where you can really get into all the different scenes in the B-roll footage. And each of the scenes has these little dots at the top where you can adjust the length. Or if you want to switch out any of these scenes, select the one you want to change. And then first here, you can either upload your own footage by clicking this upload media option, or you can search for InVideo's library footage here. If I type in a uh, space, for example, and then InVideo is going to bring up all the space shots that it's got. And just by clicking on any of these scenes, it's going to switch it out and replace that scene for me. Now, if you want to adjust the script, you can click on edit script. And now here you can get into any part of the script you want and you can type in more content if you want to add stuff or just delete stuff that you don't want to be in there. And when it comes to edit the music in this section, we've got lots of different music options to choose from. And when we come back out of this, when you're happy with your final video comes the download button, which is just here. And now here we've got the options to download the video with no watermarks. Oh, by the way, if you want to remove the watermark, you have to have a paid plan of InVideo AI. And then we've got the option to select the resolution we want to download the video in. Click continue and you start to download your video. Now, as I mentioned at the beginning of this video, InVideo AI has a free plan. So if you want to test it out yourself and use the free plan, then you can access that via the link in the description below this video. And then pay plan to start at $20 per month or $48 per month for the max plan, which is pretty reasonable. This is not overly expensive at all. And think if you want to grow a faceless YouTube channel with this tool, it'd be able to create videos in minutes. You'd be able to churn out lots and lots of videos every single week. So this price is actually extremely reasonable. Now this is the yearly pricing plan. If you prefer to pay monthly, then it's $25 per month or $60 per month. Still well worth it in my opinion, if you want to build a faceless YouTube channel and you don't want to spend your lifetime actually making the videos yourself. So that's how you can create faceless YouTube videos really fast using AI. Now, if you got value out of this video, then please do like, share and subscribe. It really helps my channel out a lot and I really appreciate it. And also, if you want to see a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to create faceless TikTok videos with AI, then watch this video here. Or a step-by-step -step tutorial show you how to create YouTube shorts with AI, then watch this video here.